Okay, today we're going to talk about an interesting little free app I downloaded onto my iPhone and it's called GPS Kit Free. And what that does, it tracks my progress when I'm walking, riding, driving, moving around and I can then take the information off my phone, uh, email it to myself and then I can take that route and overlay it on a Google map or on Google Earth. So we're going to start it up in just a minute here and I'll show you how it works. All we do is we press the start button and now we're tracking. So I'm off on my walk now and uh, we'll come back and see how it works later. Okay, here we are back from our little walk and we've got it all mapped out on the GPS tracker using this free app called GPS Kit. Maggie and I have gone for a nice, well, probably a 2 or 3k walk, so let's go take a look and see what we got. Okay, so here we are on the search screen for downloading applications to your iPhone. I typed in GPS Kit. Now the first hit is going to be the paid for version, which is uh, $9.99. That means no ads. That might be worth doing. Uh, it looks like also you have can have um, multiple colored paths. The one I'm using is a free version and um, all you do is click install. It says open on mine because I've already installed it. Okay, so we've come back from our walk having installed the GPS kit free and you can see right here that it shows uh, well first of all that little blue dot is where we are right now at home and then it quite clearly shows you the route that we went walking on right there so what we need to do now is to somehow get this mapping data or actually the waypoints uh, that were taken by the phone and mapped out here and we want to overlay them to Google Maps and or Google Earth. So the way we're going to do that is we go over to the saved data screen, uh, we pick the track, which is this one, and then we click detail, and then in the middle here it says options, so we want to pick options, and then we click export. Okay, now it already has my email address in there, so I'm ready to go and I'll just click send. Now it asks me what size. Um, it looks like a fairly small, you know, it's less than a megabyte, so we'll send the whole thing. And it tells me that the data is exported, so we'll go over to the computer next and pick up our email and I'll show you exactly how to get that data put onto your own map. Okay, so here's the email that my iPhone sent to my email address and it looks like it sent me several files. Um, you can see them all here at the bottom and the one that we're looking for initially is going to be the KML file down here. This one is the track which we overlay on Google Maps. So let's save this track to our desktop. And we can leave the, uh, the name default and it's already on desktop. Okay, here we are on the Google homepage. So we will just go down to Maps. And we'll click My Places. Then we hit Create Map. Then we click on the Import link. Then we go to Choose Our File. There it is, our track. So we click Open. And then we click on upload from file and voila there is our route now if you want to send this map information to a friend 
This is also very easy. If you extend this back out, you will see that right next to my places is a little link button. So you click on the link button and there is the address here and here is the URL of the map with the overlay included. All you need to do is copy that and paste it into an email. So let's try that. So here we are in our email and we will click write new email and paste our link in here and then whoever we want to send it to and away it goes. And that's how you do it.